I was offered the opportunity um, by a friend of mine, Steve Cram, who had spoken here before. So he offered the opportunity, said that there was a spot available to come and talk at this event, and I thought it would be a great chance. I love Newcastle. I like uh, making the most of uh, opportunities to come up here and visit the city, and so uh, it, was, uh, it was great for me to come here and talk this evening. I think I've found since I retired that there's a lot of things in common between succeeding as an athlete and trying to succeed in business and knowing your strengths and weaknesses is uh, probably one of the key ones for me and not being afraid to ask for help. I mean I think tonight is a, is a great example why. Uh, again we had a great speaker in Karen Pickering, won more than 75 medals here and if you see the turnout tonight yeah, it's a good mix of graduates, business in the northeast, sponsors, even our charity was here tonight yeah, and everybody enjoyed it yeah, and walked away with a lot of inspiration. I think business schools are really important um, and it's an area I know I'm lacking in. You know, I have lots of ideas and lots of things I want to do and I have to get advice from someone who understands business to help me actually put that into practice. So I think it's really key because there's so many people out there who have great ideas but maybe don't know how to activate it. So it's the same thing, you know, they've got a goal and they need a way to achieve it and actually studying at a business school will help them achieve their goal. I know that Newcastle is a great place to come to university. I know people have a great time when they're here so I'm sure you don't have any trouble attracting people to Newcastle Uni. <laughs>